Welcome to Cita Tech. Let's take a look at how to change your default apps on Windows 10. So I'm going to quickly jump into my settings. I'm going to choose system over here in the top left hand corner and then down towards the bottom of the screen we have default apps. Clicking in here will allow me to choose my default apps for email, maps, music player, photo viewer, video player, and even web browser. Now some of these apps, um, if I click on Mail, you see I can choose from Google Chrome, Mail, or look for an app in the actual Microsoft App Store. So if I don't have any other apps that will actually handle that application, it's going to default to what Windows comes with. But notice with the actual music, I can even choose Windows Media Player. And the main one that I was worried about was the web browser. So I've changed it from the actual Microsoft Edge to Google Chrome. And what changing default apps will effectively do is whenever you click on a link, say if I clicked on a link that was going to send an email to someone, it's going to open up the mail app. If I click on a link that is a web link in an email, it's going to open up Google Chrome. If I click on a link that's a video, it'll play in movies and TV. So these apps are just going to kind of handle the default applications for whatever sort of links you end up clicking on. There's even choose default apps by file type. This is more kind of an advanced option here. So you can see, I see the actual file type over here and I can see the app that it's going to choose to open when that sort of file is, is clicked on. So there's, I, I can come in here and change it for every single file type. I can have one file open in this app, another file open in that app. So it doesn't really matter. As you can see here on uh, Windows, there's quite a few different sort of file types to choose to open with different apps. I can even choose apps by protocol. So here I have the name Bing Maps, choose the default app, Bing Weather, Calculator. So these are specific apps associated with specific calls. So I have Facebook Events, Facebook Messenger. So I, these are different protocols that I can come in here and choose for what happens whenever I choose to do that. And I can even set defaults by app. So these are my default programs. If I were to say choose Google Chrome, I can set this as default or choose defaults for this program. And I can come through and click each one of these lists and see a detailed description of what the app is, set this program as default for all file types and protocols, and even choose what file types and protocols. So this window is kind of ineffective because everything can be done from within inside the settings. But if you wanted to see every application that you can do with defaults, choosing set apps by default will show you all the list here quickly. But these are the main apps that you need to really worry about is email, maps, music player, photos, video, and then your web browser. So that's how you change your default apps on Windows 10. For more videos like this, be sure to subscribe to State of Tech. We'll see you in the next video.